Hey, awesome! You got a drone. Congrats, dude. So now what? Let's run outside and fly it, right? Woohoo! And not so fast. There are a few things you need to know before you can throttle that puppy up. Are you allowed to fly? Where can you fly? I'm Adam Dowd with Board at Work, and this is everything you need to know before you fly. So first things first, do you need to register your drone? Well, that depends. If your drone weighs more than this... Wait, one second. Then this, then yes, you need to register with the FAA. Wait a minute, hold the phone. When this video was made, this was the truth. But as of May 19th, 2017, you no longer need to register your drone. Hooray, right? Well, sort of. Some model pilot enthusiasts are not thrilled. The registration system was a way to get pilots to learn to fly safely, after all. And the drone industry is still in its infancy, so the rules may change again. We'll be following the story here at Board at Work, and we'll be certain to post an update to this video if and when that actually changes again. Now, back to your regularly scheduled program. Also, to fly a drone, you need to be over the age of 13. Or be with someone who is. So you're good to go now, right? Eh, not quite. Next, you need to check your airspace. If you're flying indoors, no worries there. But if you're outside, FAA regulations require you to contact air traffic control if you plan to be flying within five miles of an airport. And we're not just talking about O'Hare. We're talking about local, regional airports, plus helipads. There are approximately four airports within five miles of my house. So hit the phone book and get those numbers. The FAA asks for a reasonable amount of effort in contacting these institutions. Once you're set in a location, keep in mind some rules, which are honestly mostly common sense. These rules include fly during the day, no night missions I'm afraid, fly under 400 feet of altitude, keep the drone in sight at all times, fly at or below 100 miles an hour, do not fly over people or groups of people, don't fly from a moving vehicle, and always yield the right of way to manned aircraft. Finally, always be aware of special events and conditions which call for no-fly zones. Even Lady Gaga has to obey the don't fly over special events rule. The FAA's awful but useful app, Before You Fly, will be helpful in that regard, even if the experience is tremendously awful. Aside from all that, enjoy your drone! Be sure to check out Board at Work for more drone reviews and commentary. Once again, I'm Adam Dowd, Dead Technology on Twitter, reminding you to fly safe, fly legal, and of course, always enjoy your entertainment.